Hola, hola, eh. Hola, hola, eh. Hola, 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 eh. Y'all, I am doing so many fucking recorders that I don't know if I have a show or not. I think today is a show. Because before there was a cry for my friend. So that is not a show. That is a cry for my friend. I cried like a newborn baby. A newborn fucking baby. Okay, so anyway, I got gym today. And today's show is all about the reasons why you don't have adult friends. And this is not true for me because I always have friends. I think I have friends anyway, but now I don't have friends. So my reason for real is because I'm being stalked and held hostage. But for other people, it could be something different. Um, This is the thing that I'm hearing, though. It's like somebody saying, well, I didn't know what to do. Um. If any bitch, and I mean female, nigga too, you know, he a bitch too, has any information out there about me, and you are going through my information like you a fucking stalker, right? You listening through my walls, you've been listening in my car, and I'm telling you to stop, you listen to the show, and you have the nerve to say that you don't know what to do. After 11, 12 years of fucking up my son's life, fucking up my life, telling people all this bullshit about me that's not true, taking my child away. You also took the dog, right? You have put me in poverty, and you keep saying that you don't know what to do. You know what to do. You just don't want to do what's right for me because what's right for me puts you in jail. And that's the shit I'm talking about. I have not spent my entire life creating bonds and relationships with people for somebody to just come through and roll through my shit like it's willy-nilly. Like it's okay for you to do what you're doing because your excuse is you don't know what to do. The reason why you won't come to my door is because you know I just start beating the fuck out of you for all the right fucking reasons. The other thing I thought about is I want to be a surgeon. And if I got to go to jail, I want to see if I want to be a plastic surgeon or a neurosurgeon or just a heart surgeon or if I need to just like fix a gallbladder or whatever. And all I need is a body. I need a fucking cadaver. That's the fuck. That's the shit I'm talking about. Like you have actually driven me fucking crazy. And the thing is, I don't want Just somebody that got the rumors. I want the person that actually implements every fucking plan to fuck with me and fuck with my goddamn life. You see? Because you are fucking with the time that I have on earth and the people that I could be spending that time with. That's the shit I'm talking about. And like I said, if I have to spend the last days going to jail, all I need is a cadaver. That's all I need. I just want to practice. I want to see... If these stitches really hold up, I know they won't have time to heal because I'm going to ensure that you dead before I fuck with you. That's all I'm trying to tell you. That's why you won't come knock on this fucking door. Because if you knocked on the fucking door, I'm fucking your face up so that they don't recognize you. I'm putting pieces of it all over the fucking world. I'm going to send it to people that I don't even fucking know. No harm against them. No foul. They just don't know what it is. I just say, could you please throw it away for me? The heart part, I want to see if it's something in your heart, like the valves that can match the lung valve. So if that one lung valve could just actually be switched around, and then I'll drop your body off at the morgue. That's how the fuck I think. You want to know some more? So let's talk about adult friendships. 
you are headed a new direction. That's true. Sometimes you are, and you got to drop people off where the fuck they are. Come write me again. Send somebody over here to write me again. Send them, send them over here to write me again. Send a rapist. You don't have friends because you built an emotional wall. I don't have emotional walls because I'm very honest about who I am and what it is I need from people. So I don't have to do that. I don't think other people do too. Now that people been setting up shit in my life, that's how I fucking feel. Some of y'all got letters on y'all chest. I want to see if I could like make a letter out with the parts inside your body too. Like if I could take your veins and like spell out AKA or Alpha Phi Alpha or Sigma Gamma Rho or Phi Beta Sigma or Zeta Phi Beta. Because y'all the motherfuckers, they got the problems. You see? And y'all didn't know I was crazy. So send somebody over here that's just as crazy as me. Let's play. Because I want to be a fucking surgeon. You don't have close relationships because you constantly take in take in your friendships. You don't have close relationships because you constantly take in your friendships. I don't know what that means. I like to have close relationships. That's all I'm trying to get to right now. Is to get to the people that I want to love and want to love on me. That's all I want. I don't need no more of your trauma, your traumatic situations, all y'all shit talking about y'all don't know what to do. Bitch, you didn't have to do nothing. You didn't have to do anything but get me out of the domestic violence situation. But no, you keep me wrapped up with domestic violent motherfuckers. And then you think that I'm supposed to be okay with that. Like that shit's supposed to make me fucking happy just because somebody fussed at me and it matched a goddamn song. Bitch, I'm not playing with you. I have been through too much traumatic stress. You have been doing the same thing to my fucking child. I will fucking kill you. A cadaver is all the fuck I need. I just want to play before I go to jail. You don't have real friends because you are holding on to relationships that aren't working. No, those relationships that don't work, hold on to me. I don't hold on to them because I already let them go. But the bitch won't knock on my fucking door because all I need is a fucking cadaver. Please, this is Shantae with Brown Sugar Talks and the Black Unicorns telling you all to please have a good fucking day. Eat some Cheerios, it's good for your heart.